everybody, welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. I have a crafty type project to show you today. I think it's really, really cool. It's actually kind of versatile. It can be used as a small gift for children, especially for traveling, or if they're going to be sitting places, which you know children, when you go to a restaurant, they're always looking for something to keep them busy, and this is one of those things. But this could also be used as a wedding favor, and it kind of has the same role. When you're sitting at a wedding and you're waiting while the bride and groom are taking pictures, you're waiting for food, things like that, Adults can get a little bit bored too and need something to do. So this is also something that you can make as wedding favors to sit on your table and this will give the adults something to do and play while they wait. Let's get started. Today we're gonna be making little bags full of these little beads. However, they're going to have a different use today. We are going to make tic-tac-toe bags. They are going to be so cute. We're going to use these little guys as our X's and O's, and they can be used in, I have these little drawstring bags. This one is a cute little burlap drawstring bag. I also have a white linen drawstring bag. You can really purchase these anywhere. Like I said in the beginning, craft stores have them. Sometimes you can even find them at the Dollar Tree. So they're very, very inexpensive. And the same with these little guys as well. They're just round and they're flat on the back, but they have a nice shiny round surface. And so this is what we're gonna use for our X's and O's. The creation of games like this can actually be traced back to ancient Egypt and an early variation of tic-tac-toe was played in the Roman Empire around the first century BC. It was called Turni La Pieli, which stands for three pebbles at a time. In 1952, one of the first known computer games was created by a British scientist and the game was called OXO. It was a form of tic-tac-toe that you could play on the computer. In this version of the game, the player, or the human, would play against the computer. Tic-tac-toe has been played for many years and it's still played today. There are some fast food restaurants where you can go in and they have a big version of tic-tac-toe to keep the kids occupied. So this is something that you can just throw in your purse and you can have a game ready and available for your kids when they need something to do. You really don't need a lot for this project, but what you will need is a ruler, some little bags that have drawstrings. You can get these at the Dollar Tree or any craft store. Some little, they're almost like little marbles, but they're flat on the back. You can as well get these at any craft store or even sometimes you can find them at the Dollar Tree. You'll also need some permanent markers. And if you are going to make this as a favor for a wedding, you're gonna want a pretty stamp, maybe something like this. Um, you'll also want a permanent black ink pad. Let's get started. You need 10 of these so that you can have five X's and five O's. I'm gonna use red and black permanent markers for mine. And first I'm gonna start with the X's. You wanna make sure you use permanent markers so that the marker doesn't rub off after it dries. Next, I'm gonna use the black marker to make my O's. all of my little pebbles finished. I'm gonna make my lines on my burlap bag. I'm gonna use a ruler and my black permanent marker to make sure that my lines are fairly straight.
just like that. And now your game is ready to play. You can also buy little round Velcro pieces that have sticky on the back to put on the back of these and on the back of your sack if you prefer. That would then allow the pieces to stay in place if you were traveling or moving in a car or something like that. But otherwise, if you're just at a restaurant, this would work perfectly fine. And when you're finished, you just gather up all your pieces and put them inside the bag to go. All right, everybody. So as you can see, this is a quick and simple yet also inexpensive project that you can make. Either something for children so that you can take something along to give them something to do, or look how cute it turned out with this little tag. You can make them as wedding favors. You can even put on the back side the name of the bride and groom and the date they were married, or something along those lines, and put these on tables at a wedding reception. That would be really cute, and then it would also give the guests something to do while they waited for the festivities to continue on. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned a quick and easy way, something that you can do. Um, I see these little bags all the time and I don't always know what to do with them. I also feel the same way about these little beads. They're really only used um, to put in vases and decorative things like that. So I was glad I found another use for them and they make really, really cute X's and O's for tic-tac-toe. So I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe and have fun making your little tic-tac-toe bags. Bye.